Hey people, what's happening? Dom here from COVID Performance. I'm taking advantage of the lovely weather in Queensland for a change. So I thought what I'd do, I'd get out here while it wasn't pissing down rain, pardon the French, and I would make up some brackets for the inner cooler and chuck the inner cooler on. So in saying that, I've used a few little hand tools here, like a drill, square tape measure pretty much did everything on the ground because my bench is just full of stuff at the moment and i've managed to get this on here all i did was made a bracket to go onto this support here i don't really know what that's originally for it might be for the bump uh, bumper bar bit of angle holes drilled another bit of angle just tacked it on there for now on both sides I've left the longer bolts in there so I can make an adjustment and yeah I don't I don't reckon it looks too bad I had another Q45 a couple of years ago with the RB20 and the intercooler was massive like it was bigger than that one it was I would say wider and and longer and deeper so yeah on the other come just trying to think I think it was out to around it was out here somewhere on both so hey, we'll say 50 60 mil wider I think this might have been a bit wider as well anyway it was RB20 Neo with a turbo and it's also on my YouTube channel somewhere I don't have it anymore but it used to go all right but this thing here is going to go a lot better because these engines have got a, a lot of torque off boost so I'm pretty excited hopefully I can get a few more things done this week I want to cut around where the wastegate is to allow me to put the wastegate on because it's just an elbow there at the moment I want to do that also i want to get a v-band i think it's a three and a quarter inch v-band for the gt45 so that i can run the exhaust i'll just swap it over i can show you so the bonnet's closed at the moment but plan is so gt45 is going to be there and the pipe is going to go like that and down i'll make one pipe to come out here for now and then in the future I may get some slotted pipe so I could go underneath I don't really have a lot of clearance that's the that's the piping at the moment I think I'm about hundred and something off the ground still haven't lowered the car either I'll be putting those wheels on it so these ones are going to come off and I'll probably drop it down on coilovers. Yeah, so it's going to be pretty low. But that's the way we have to do things. I can hear... Ooh, I'm not wearing sunnies. How's that for a change? I can hear an ambo. Maybe they're coming along because they're afraid that this Q45 is just going to have that much power. It's just going to wrap itself instantly around the telegraph pole. So, anyway, guys, enough bullshit talk or whatever you want to call it. Um, this thing here, I want to take advantage of the nice sort of, like I said, the nice Queensland weather without torrential rain. I want to try and get as much done on this thing this week. This is just a quick little, I guess it's like an intermission episode if you want to call it that so the next time i talk to you guys i want to have that cut out i want to have the wastegate on the turbo sitting on there at least at least oh oh trying to adjust it uh, oh 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 man bloody freaking android phones Anyway guys, have a good one, thanks for joining and I'll talk to you in the next episode.
Ja, ja, ja. 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 Ja, ja, ja.